Governor Mike DeWine has announced he'll create a new traffic safety council to find ways to keep drivers safe on the roads. OSP reports this July was Ohio's deadliest month on the road since 2007. 2 News reporter Kiana Deitches explains how Miami Valley officers are working to get those numbers down. Officers here in Kettering are focusing their enforcement efforts on removing impaired drivers from local roadways. We usually do have increased presence where we're looking for impaired drivers. According to Governor DeWine, 154 people were killed on Ohio highways in July, making it the most deadly on state roadways since 2007. This Labor Day weekend, local officers say they're working overtime to bring those numbers down. We have a higher volume of traffic. Uh, we've had some OVIs. Um, really what we're trying to remind people is if you're wherever you're traveling uh, to go um, kind of prep your trip so you know your route. Uh, make sure your car is ready. Officials say majority of July's crashes across the state stem from speed. Officer Farrow says locally the concerns vary. Our biggest concerns are speed, impaired driving, and distracted driving. When it comes to impaired driving, it goes without saying to don't drink and drive. When it comes to distracted driving, we're just reminding people, put your cell phone down. That way you're going to get safely to whatever gathering you're going to and you can enjoy yourself. There. Drivers out on Labor Day say they're noticing busier roads. There's definitely more people out, and especially you know, at the beginning of this year the streets were super empty due to COVID, but now it seems like everyone's just kind of out and about more. And Kettering, Keanu Deutsches, 2 News, working for you.